in this sacred moment, let us turn inward and embrace the profound wisdom that resides within the depths of our being, uh, a wisdom that whispers to us of the transformative power of metaphorically ghosting everyone and transcending the limitations imposed by societal expectations, limiting beliefs, and the constant noise of external validation. As we settle into a state of meditative stillness, uh, allowing the rhythmic flow of our breath to anchor us in the present moment, we bear witness to the profound liberation that can arise when we let go of the need to conform, to seek approval, or to shape our lives according to the ever-shifting tides of societal norms and cultural conditions. Imagine the profound sense of freedom that arises when we ghost the limiting beliefs and self-imposed constraints that have kept us tethered to patterns of behavior, thought processes, and ways of being that no longer serve our highest growth and evolution. In this liberated state, we awaken to the understanding that our true essence, our authentic self, is not defined by the roles we play, the labels we adopt, or the expectations placed upon us by others, but rather it is a vast, ever unfolding expression of the infinite potential that resides within each of us. As we breathe into this practice of ghosting everyone, we let go of the belief that our worth or our value is contingent upon external validation or societal acceptance. Instead, we um, cultivate a deep sense of self-trust and inner knowing, recognizing that the guidance we seek to navigate the complexities of life's journey resides not in the opinions or judgments of others, but within the depths of our own being. Imagine the profound liberation that arises when we let go of the need to conform to societal norms or to adhere to the predetermined paths that have been laid out for us. In, in this liberated state, we awaken to the understanding that our lives are not meant to be lived according to a predetermined script, but rather they are vast blank canvases upon which we are invited to paint the masterpiece of our own unique expression. As we breathe into this practice, we let go of the limiting belief that our dreams, our passions, or our highest aspirations must align with the expectations of others or the dominant cultural narratives. Instead, we embrace the understanding that our true purpose is not to live a life that is deemed acceptable or respectable by societal standards, but rather to fully embody the authentic expression of our souls, to pursue the paths that ignite our deepest joys, to give voice to our truths, and to uh, contribute our unique gifts and talents to the world in a way that is aligned with our deepest values and inner callings. In this sacred space, we ghost the belief that we must conform to uh, rigid gender roles, cultural stereotypes, or societal impositions of how we should think, behave, or express ourselves. We let go of the fear of judgment or rejection, and instead we embrace the understanding that our authenticity, our unique expression, is a sacred gift to be celebrated and shared with the world not a source of shame or something to be hidden away. Imagine the profound sense of empowerment that arises when we let go of the need to seek validation or approval from others, and instead, we cultivate a deep sense of self-acceptance and self-love. In this liberated state, we ghost the voices of doubt, criticism, and self-judgment that have kept us small, and instead, we embrace the understanding that we are inherently worthy, inherently valuable, simply by virtue of our existence. As we breathe into this practice, we let go of the belief that our worth or our value is contingent upon our achievements, our possessions, or our social status. Instead, we awaken to the understanding that our true worth is an innate and inalienable aspect of our being, a worth that is not diminished by our perceived failures or shortcomings, nor is it enhanced by our successes or accomplishments. In this sacred space, we ghost the belief that we must sacrifice our authenticity, our values, or our integrity in order to achieve success, recognition, or material wealth. 
We let go of the fear of standing out or being perceived as different. And instead, we embrace the understanding that our uniqueness, our individuality, is a source of strength and power, a wellspring of creativity and innovation that has the potential to reshape and transform the world around us. Imagine the profound impact that this practice of ghosting everyone can have on our personal growth, our relationships, and our collective pursuit of a more just, compassionate, and sustainable world. For in the absence of limiting beliefs and self-imposed constraints, we are better equipped to show up fully present, authentically vulnerable, and deeply connected to ourselves and to those around us. As we breathe into this practice, we bear witness to the formation of powerful communities of like-minded individuals, each committed to the path of self-actualization and the embodiment of their authentic truth. Within these sacred spaces, we hold one another accountable, offering support, guidance, and encouragement as we navigate the challenges and triumphs that inevitably arise on our respective journeys. Together, we co-create a powerful collective energy, a vibration of authenticity, self-acceptance, and unwavering commitment to living our truth that reverberates through the very fabric of our reality, amplifying our ability to manifest positive change and contribute our unique gifts and talents to the world around us. In these liberated spaces, we let go of the limiting beliefs that have perpetuated cycles of oppression, marginalization, and systemic injustice, and instead, we embrace a profound respect for the inherent dignity and worth of all beings. We ghost the societal narratives and cultural conditioning that have historically excluded or devalued certain groups. And instead, we cultivate a deep reverence for the tapestry of our diversity recognizing that it is through the authentic expression of our unique perspectives, experiences, and ways of being that we co-create a world that is rich, vibrant, and reflective of the boundless creativity of the human spirit. And as we continue to embody this practice of ghosting everyone, we bear witness to a profound shift in the way we approach our relationship with the natural world. A shift that is rooted in a deep reverence for the intricate web of life that sustains us and a commitment to living in harmonious balance with the rhythms and cycles of nature. We ghost the limiting belief that our planet is a resource to be exploited and consumed and instead we embrace a mindset of stewardship and regeneration one that recognizes our interconnectedness with all life and our responsibility to protect and nurture the delicate ecosystems upon which our collective well-being depends. Imagine a world where individuals and communities are empowered to take intentional action to preserve and regenerate our natural environments to adopt sustainable practices that minimize our ecological footprint and to seek innovative solutions that allow us to meet our needs without compromising the ability of future generations to meet theirs. In this liberated state, we cultivate a deep sense of reverence and reciprocity in our interactions with the natural world, understanding that our well-being is inextricably linked to the well-being of our planet and that it is through our authentic connection and our willingness to live in harmony with the natural order that we can co-create a world that is in harmonious balance. And as we breathe into this practice of ghosting everyone, we bear witness to a profound transformation in the way we approach our personal and professional lives. A transformation that is rooted in the understanding that true fulfillment and self-actualization arise, not from the pursuit of external validation or material wealth, but from the deep sense of purpose and meaning that comes from aligning our actions with our deepest values and authentic expression.
Imagine a world where individuals are empowered to pursue their passions and to contribute their unique gifts and talents to the world free from the limiting beliefs and societal expectations that have historically constrained personal and professional growth. In this liberated state, we cultivate a culture of innovation, creativity, and entrepreneurship, one that celebrates the diversity of human expression and recognizes the inherent value in each individual's unique perspective and approach. We ghost the belief that success is measured solely by financial gain or status, and instead, we embrace a more holistic understanding of prosperity one that recognizes the inherent value in pursuing work that is aligned with our deepest callings that contributes to the greater good. And that allows us to fully express our authentic selves. As we breathe into this practice, we bear witness to a renaissance of purpose-driven ventures and social enterprises, organizations that are built upon a foundation of ethical values, environmental stewardship, and a genuine commitment to uplifting the lives of those they serve. We let go of the limiting belief that profit and positive impact are mutually exclusive, and instead we co-create business models that prioritize the well-being of all stakeholders, recognizing that true and lasting success arises from a harmonious balance between financial sustainability and a genuine commitment to creating positive change in the world. Imagine a world where workplaces are not merely environments of productivity and profit, but rather sacred spaces that nurture the growth, well-being, and self-actualization of all those who inhabit them. In this liberated state, we cultivate organizational cultures that prioritize authenticity, creative self-expression, and a deep sense of purpose and meaning recognizing that when individuals are empowered to bring their full, authentic selves to their work, they are better equipped to contribute their unique gifts and talents to the collective mission. As we breathe into this practice of ghosting everyone, we bear witness to a profound transformation in the way we approach education, a transformation that is rooted in the understanding that true learning is not merely the acquisition of knowledge, but a lifelong journey of self-discovery, personal growth, and the cultivation of the skills and mindsets necessary to thrive as our fully expressed, authentic selves. We ghost. The outdated belief that education is a one-size-fits-all endeavor, and instead we embrace a more holistic and personalized approach, one that recognizes the unique learning styles, interests, passions, and aptitudes of each individual learner, and that seeks to nurture the full spectrum of human potential. Imagine a world where learners of all ages are empowered to take an active role in shaping their educational journeys, pursuing areas of study that ignite their curiosities and feed their souls, while engaging in experiential learning opportunities that allow them to apply their knowledge in real-world contexts that are meaningful and relevant to their unique life experiences. In this liberated state, we cultivate environments that foster critical thinking, creativity, emotional intelligence, and a deep sense of global citizenship, uh, recognizing that the challenges of our rapidly changing world require not merely mastery of academic disciplines, but the development of a broad range of skills, mindsets, and self-awareness that will enable individuals to continually adapt, innovate, and show up as their most often authentic and empowered selves. And as we breathe into this practice of ghosting everyone, we bear witness to a profound shift in the way we approach our personal growth, self-care, and overall well-being. Uh, a shift that is rooted in the understanding that true wellness is not merely the absence of illness or distress, but a holistic state of physical, mental, emotional, and spiritual balance that allows us to fully embody our authentic selves and live from a place of vibrancy, resilience, and joy. 
we go to the limiting belief that self-care is a luxury or an indulgence, and instead we embrace it as a fundamental necessity, a sacred practice that nourishes our overall well-being and empowers us to show up in the world with greater presence, authenticity, and vitality. Imagine a world where individuals are empowered to prioritize their self-care and personal growth, engaging in practices and modalities that promote physical vitality, emotional intelligence, mindfulness, and spiritual awareness. In this liberated state, we cultivate a culture that recognizes the inherent value in nurturing our whole selves, understanding that it is through the integration and authentic expression of our physical, mental, emotional, and spiritual dimensions that we unlock our full potential as co-creators of a more just, compassionate, and sustainable world. As we continue to breathe into this practice, we bear witness to the profound impact it can have on our relationships and our sense of community. For in the absence of limiting beliefs, societal impositions, and self-imposed constraints, we are better equipped to show up fully present, authentically vulnerable and deeply connected to ourselves and those around us. Imagine a world where our relationships are built upon a foundation of mutual understanding, respect, and a genuine desire to uplift and support one another on our individual journeys of growth, self-discovery, and authentic self-expression. In, in this liberated state, we ghost the belief that our worth or our value is contingent upon external validation or societal norms, and instead, we embrace the unique and inherent beauty of our authentic selves and those of our loved ones. We cultivate relationships that are rooted in open, honest, and vulnerable communication where we feel empowered to express our truths, our vulnerabilities, and our deepest desires without fear of judgment or rejection. And within these sacred spaces of connection, we hold one another accountable with love, offering gentle guidance, support, and encouragement as we navigate the challenges and triumphs that inevitably arise on our respective paths of self actual as we breathe into uh, this practice, we bear witness to the formation of powerful communities of like-hearted individuals, each committed to living their truth, embracing their authenticity, and co-creating a world that celebrates and uplifts the inherent dignity and worth of all beings. Within these liberated spaces, we let go of the cultural narratives and societal conditioning that have historically divided us, pitting us against one another based on arbitrary distinctions of race, religion, gender, or ideology. Instead, we embrace the understanding that our differences are not sources of division or conflict, but rather they are the threads that weave together the tapestry of our shared human experience, a tapestry that is rich, vibrant, and reflective of the boundless creativity and diversity of the human spirit. In these sacred communities, we hold space for one another to explore, to question, to challenge the status quo, and to continually evolve in our understanding and expression of our authentic selves. We cultivate environments that are rooted in a spirit of curiosity, open-mindedness, and a genuine desire to learn from one another's unique perspectives and life experiences. And as we continue to embody this practice of ghosting everyone, we bear witness to a profound shift in the way we approach our collective pursuit of social justice, equity, and systemic change. A shift that is rooted in the understanding that true transformation arises not from top-down institutional channels, but rather from the ground up through the intentional actions and authentic expression of individuals and communities committed to embodying their highest visions and aspirations. Imagine a world where individuals from all walks of life are empowered to identify the pressing challenges, inequities, and systemic injustices within their communities and to take bold intentional action to address them, right? not from a place of anger, resentment, or rigid ideology, 
but from a place of love, compassion, and a genuine desire to co-create a more just, equitable, and sustainable world for all. In this liberated state, we cultivate a culture of civic engagement, social responsibility, and authentic activism, where every individual recognizes the power they hold to shape and mold the world around them through the choices they make, the actions they take, and the energy they bring to their pursuits. We ghost the belief that meaningful change can only be achieved through violent uprisings, destructive protests, or the demonization of those with differing perspectives and ideologies. Instead, we embrace the understanding that true and lasting transformation arises from a place of nonviolent resistance, radical compassion, and a willingness to engage in open, honest, and vulnerable dialogue with those whom we may perceive as adversaries. Imagine a world where individuals and communities are empowered to seek innovative, collaborative solutions that address the root causes of injustice, inequality, and systemic oppression. Solutions that uplift the dignity and worth of all involved, and that seek to create a more just, equitable, and sustainable world for all. In this liberated state, we bear witness to a flourishing of grassroots initiative, community-based organizations, and social enterprises, all fueled by the collective understanding that our well-being is inextricably linked to the well-being of our global community. And that it is through our authentic expression, our intentional actions, and our commitment to uplifting one another that we can co-create a world that reflects the highest aspirations of humanity. And as we breathe into this practice of ghosting everyone, we bear witness to a profound transformation in the way we approach our relationship with the natural world. A transformation that is rooted in a deep reverence for the intricate web of life that sustains us and a commitment to living in harmonious balance with the rhythms and cycles of nature. The ghost, the limiting belief that our planet is a resource to be exploited and consumed, and instead we embrace a mindset of stewardship, regeneration, and reciprocity. One that recognizes our interconnectedness with all life and our responsibility to protect, nurture, and give back to the delicate ecosystems upon which our collective well-being depends. Imagine a world where individuals and communities are empowered to take intentional action to preserve and regenerate our natural environments, to adopt sustainable practices that minimize our ecological footprint, and to seek innovative solutions that allow us to meet our needs without compromising the ability of future generations to meet theirs. In this liberated state, we cultivate a deep sense of reverence, uh, we, and gratitude in our interactions with the natural world, understanding that our well-being is inextricably linked to the well-being of our planet and that it is through our authentic connection our willingness to live in harmony with the natural order and our commitment to giving back to the earth that sustains us.